What's up, everybody? Happy Monday to you all. There are only five days left until the start of football season. I hope you're geeking out because I'm definitely geeking out. Uh, we start this week off with a look at the Ducks' first opponent. That would be the Wolves of Arkansas State. Uh, at first glance, this looks like a team that could potentially give Oregon some problems. Uh, they won 10 games last year, went undefeated through the Sun Belt Conference. Uh, they are led by first-year head coach Gus Malzahn, who many of us remember as the offensive coordinator of the Auburn Tigers in 2010. Uh, and they're led by 2011 Sun Belt Player of the Year Ryan Applin, who threw for almost 3,600 yards and ran for 588 more last year. Um, so they have really a good start to a good team, but once you dig deeper, you begin to see that this Arkansas State team is due for some regression in 2012, and there's a reason why Oregon are the heavy favorites coming into this game. Applin may be a star, but he's surrounded by some pretty suspect talent. Um, this is an offense in transition going from Hugh Freeze's uh, pass-happy scheme to more of a run-oriented look with Gus Malzahn. That's what he's known for. And this group of running backs only combined as a unit last year for 1,300, 1,400 yards, somewhere in that range. Ryan Applin actually the leading rusher last year with 588 yards on the ground. So that can tell you the priority they put on the running game last year and trying to make that transition to a run-heavy look um, will encounter some bumps, especially with uh, former Auburn running back Michael Dyer's uh, waiver being denied so he could play this season and then his subsequent dismissal from the team. Uh, at wide receiver, they lost their uh, leading receiver from last year, Dwayne Frampton, uh, and they just had wide receivers Trey Houston and Earl Lucas lost to suspension for the year over this past weekend. Um, and then their offensive line, not a good group last year, uh, lots of room for improvement, and you know I don't have high hopes for the unit at all. Uh, so this is definitely a, a offense that our defense can exploit. We can force turnovers, we can get to the quarterback. Uh, Applin may be talented, but there isn't a whole lot around him. As far as the defensive side of the ball for Arkansas State, this is a group last year that prided itself on its pass rush, um, but this is going to be a young front seven. They lost 26 and a half total sacks from last year. Um, so there will be a lot of young players and their first game in Autzen Stadium. I just don't know that uh, we're going to see that improvement right away. And their secondary last year, much like their offensive line, wasn't great. Lots of room for improvement. And frankly, I don't expect to see that in game one in Autzen Stadium. Uh, so this is definitely a defense that can be taken advantage of for a lot of points. And their offense, while Applin is good, uh, he's pretty much all they got. So that's a first look at Arkansas State. Uh, stay tuned for the rest of the week for more Oregon-Arkansas State coverage. For AddictedToQuack.com, go Ducks.